This tutorial is powered by AskQuesty.com. Get help with your website on demand. And don't forget, subscribe for more tutorials. Hi everyone, so today I'm going to show you how to edit your footer in WordPress. There's actually a lot of ways you can do this depending on what you want to accomplish. Uh, most themes will actually have the options to edit your footer straight from the Appearance Customizer. So I can show you what that looks like if we go to Appearance and then to Customize. I will have the option here that says footer settings. So if I go into footer settings, I can see that I can change my layout. I can change my typography right here. I can change my footer elements. And I can also change the bottom bar, which is housing my uh, credits. So I can change all that uh, straight from the customizer right here. Sometimes you'll have the option, now if I get out of here, Sometimes you also have the option to change uh, your footer credits and your settings right from your theme options. So you would go to uh, extra and then theme options. Instead, you might have the option there. Uh, you can also change your uh, PHP file, your footer PHP file, if you go to appearance theme editor. As this loads. If you go to the side, it spawns in the uh, style.css file first. But if you go to the side right here, you can click into footer.php. And this will load my PHP file that's housing all my footer uh, code. So you can see I have footer info here. So I can change this code right here to change my footer credits. Uh, they do warn you uh, to make sure you know what you're doing when you're changing code like this. Uh, and they also recommend that you use a child theme if you're editing this code, because if you edit this code uh, straight from uh, the parent theme and you're not using a child theme, the next time you update your site, you will lose uh, all the customization that you have done on these files. So make sure you're using a child theme if you're going to go the route of editing uh, the footer and header, etc. PHP files. All right, so the other option, what you can do, is if you go to your site, if I scroll down, I can see that I only have a bottom bar here. I can have a footer if I had footer widgets or whatever. Uh, if you want to edit the footer widgets that you have, you would actually go into the widgets tab. I can show you that in a second. But if I click into this and if I go to inspect, so it's control shift I on uh, Windows. And if I, I can see I have my footer bottom and I have my footer right here. And I also have my container. So if I go into my footer bottom, you can see that I can change the background, the width, the padding, etc. And I can add custom code right from here. So what I would do is I would take this ID, the hashtag footer bottom, and then I would put it in my appearance custom CSS and add whatever code I wanted to add. Say if I wanted the background color to be different, if I wanted it to be red, um, etc. You can definitely do that. Uh, so you could, you would simply just add this this code into your uh, CSS file. Uh, if I, and you know if you wanted to change the uh, the text, you would add a footer bottom a, um, etc. Okay, so that's another way you can change um, the text or um, the colors and the typography of your uh, footer. Now. Uh, if you wanted to add or change the widgets, you would have to go into the widgets option right here. Okay, and you can see footer sidebar, footer sidebar right. Um, this also depends on the theme, what kind of sidebar you have or what footer options you have, but you can add uh, widgets here if you would like. Um, and then also if you go into your menus, this is where it would control if you wanted to have navigation in your footer. You would uh, select your footer menu right here or you can create one as well. It would depend on the locations that you have in your theme. If I click on manage locations here, I can see that I my theme supports three menus. Uh, that also depends on your theme, what kind of menus they support. 
but you can add your navigation here into the footer from there. Okay, so a few different ways you can change this. Like I said, you can edit the footer.php file to edit the credits. A lot of time themes will have it straight in your customized panel where you can edit your credits, your colors, your typography, et cetera. Um, and you can also just straight at, um, edit the CSS by adding custom CSS to your appearance. Um, uh, customize, if I go in here, I'll show you that really fast. And if I go down to additional CSS, I can add it straight to here and that will also um, change <clears throat> the colors uh, of this. So if I do, um, like that. So you can edit it straight from there as well. Uh, you just have to make sure you find the ID. Again, use the inspector tool so you can find the ID or the class that you want to edit and you can edit straight from there. Okay, I hope that helps and have a great day. Thanks for watching. If this was helpful, please subscribe. And if you need extra help, visit askquesty.com and send us your questions.